Welcome back to Sam Lopez TV. I'm Sam Lopez. And on today's video, I'm going to be answering some questions that were left on my Instagram story. And yeah, it should be a lot of fun. Not too many questions, but let's go ahead and answer them. All right, guys. So the first question is from at underscore Kelly JM. What's up, Kelly? The question is, what's your favorite thing to do in October? So my favorite thing to do in October is definitely bring out more creepiness than I already celebrate throughout the whole year. I love to go to haunted places. I love to, you know, check out anything really. I love to go to graveyards, love to do anything creepy. Um, I love doing haunts. Sadly, this year there won't be any haunts, but um, it's, it's, you know, I just love doing all kinds of stuff. October is my favorite month because I truly feel like I can be myself because I am really into like, dark dark stuff i'm really into horror i'm really into just the paranormal so october is my favorite month and i do a lot of exploring <laughs> all right so my next question is from at breeze what's up Bree? um what made you start doing youtube so what made me start doing youtube was so for a long time, I, I really wanted to do it, but I really ha had really bad anxiety and I never really gave myself the push to do it. I started watching a bunch of vlogs from other YouTubers and it just really inspired me. And so I made a video, edited it, and just posted it. I gave myself the push. I didn't even think about it. I just posted it. And that's what made me start doing it, just being inspired by other YouTubers. And I was like, I went on all the fun too. And plus, I, I love making content. It's a lot of fun. <laughs> Um, the next question is at Kelly M.01. What's up, Kelly? <laughs> There's two Kellys in the questions. Um, <laughs> what's your dream vacation? I would absolutely love to go to Alaska. <laughs> I know that's really random, but I love the cold weather. Well, I love cold weather. And it just, I don't know, it looks like fun. Just, I love the woods and the scenery. It looks really dope. I really want to go to Alaska. Somebody hit me up if you guys are trying to go next year. I'm totally down. <laughs> um, the next question is from at Jasmine Baby. Hey, Jasmine. That's my roll dog, Jasmine, right there. <laughs> um, what is something that you're proud of but barely get to talk about? Okay. So something that I'm proud of is I cut my... You know what, let me not even get, I'm not going to get messy. Um, <laughs> I cut out a lot of people. And I just felt like it was a very toxic situation. And I had to cut out people because you know what, I'm trying to just be a more positive person, trying to be more intuitive with my spirituality. And I just felt like all of that was just toxicity following me. And I can't do it anymore. So had to cut it, had to cut a lot of people out. But I'm proud of it. I barely talk about it, but it is what it is. <laughs> All right, so the next question is from at banana dot underscore dot babe. Hi, Nut. <laughs> I miss you, Nut. Um, what zodiac sign are you? So I'm an Aquarius. And you know what? Aquarius is we, we rule the world. <laughs> I love being an Aquarius. We're very intuitive and very friendly, but we could have our evil tendencies i think <laughs> or at least for me <laughs> um the next question is from at nightmare underscore ally 13 Ooh, what's up arlene <laughs> what is the first thing you notice in a guy you like okay i definitely notice how they carry themselves when they walk into a room and i notice their hands i don't know i'm weird I, ha I love a guy with like some good, nice hands. Like, I don't know. <laughs> it's like, I don't know. <laughs> it's weird, but um, I notice the way they carry themselves. I notice their, their hands and their eyes. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I love a guy with good hands. <laughs> um, next question is from at short 96. What's up, Shirley? Who is your biggest inspiration? Okay, so my biggest inspiration is definitely Kesha. Kesha has been my biggest inspiration for 11 years now. I love her. I love everything she stands for. I love her positivity and her amazing outlook on life. And she just, I just feel like she's such a beautiful person and a beautiful soul. 
I love her so much. I've been following her since the beginning of her journey. I know every one of her songs. Like, I'm a huge, 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 huge fan. I love Kesha. Um, she's my biggest inspiration, and she's actually the reason why I came out of the closet. And she's the reason why I am myself, because her music and her words and just everything she stands for really gave me that push to just truly be myself and accept myself. And so that's what I'm really proud of. And yeah, if it wasn't for her album, Animal, I wouldn't, I wouldn't be who I am today because that album really helped me through some dark times. And yeah, <laughs> thanks, Kesha. <laughs> uh, all right, so those are the questions for today. Um, I'll probably do another one of these in a few weeks. Um, I might want to answer some juicier questions. I did get some pretty nasty questions but i'm barely starting my youtube channel and i don't want to get flagged or like get in trouble with youtube or anything so i had to keep it cute but thank you guys for participating in the question stuff um to everybody that sent a question and thank you so much i appreciate it if you guys can go ahead and follow them and um yeah thanks so much guys for the questions and thanks for participating um so yeah thanks guys for watching this video stay safe like this video if you want i'm not going to pressure you um turn on the post notification bell leave a comment keep it cute stay safe mask up you know what to do thanks for watching everybody bye